Hey YouTube family, welcome back to the video. I hope you guys are doing extremely well. So friends, in this video, we will see the most important MCQs of unit number 6, which is Computer Arithmetic, Introduction to Parallel Processing and Latest Technology and Trends in Computer Architecture. Friends, I have already uploaded the videos of you, uh, all the units, unit number 1 to unit number 5th. You can find the link of those videos in the playlist or I will provide the link of those videos in the description box okay so let's start with the first question but i want to make a request to you guys please do subscribe the channel for more exam ready content and share these videos to your friends too okay uh, so the first question is which algorithm is commonly used for signed integer addition in computer arithmetic option is both algorithm Two's complement or floating point addition and last option is carry look ahead adder. Correct option is two's complement. Next question. In subtraction, what is borrowed when the minute digit is smaller than the subtrahend digit? Option A, 1. Option B, 10. Option C, minute digit and last option is subtrahend digit. Correct option is option A which is 1. Next question. What is the primary advantage of using both algorithm in multiplication? Option A, reduced number of partial products. Option B, improved precision in results. And uh, C option is faster execution time. And last option is better handling of floating point numbers. Correct option is option A, reduced number of partial products. Next question. What is the primary goal of pipelining in parallel processing? Option A. It minimizing the number of processors. Option B. Increasing the clock speed. C. Option is overlapping the execution of multiple instructions. And last option is reducing the interconnection complexity. Correct option is C only. Overlapping the execution of multiple instructions. Next question. Which of the following is the characteristics of multiprocessor in parallel processing? Option A. Single processor control. Option B. Limited scalability. Option C. Simplicity in programming. And last option is improved processing power. Correct option is improved processing power. Next question. What is the purpose of interconnection structure in parallel processing system? Option A. Minimizing power consumption. Option B. Managing cache memory. Option C. Is facilitating communication between processors. And last option is enhancing the clock speed. Correct option is C. Facilitating communication between processors. Guys, all these questions which I am discussing now is very important. Do not miss any questions. Otherwise, you will lose your marks in the upcoming exam. Do not miss. What distinguishes the architecture from the micro architecture of a processor? Option A clock speed, option B instruction set architecture, option C memory size, and last option is pipeline depth. Correct option is instruction set architecture. Eight number question Which term refer to the design and organization of a computer system internal components? Option A architecture, option B micro architecture, option C instruction set and last option is clock cycle. And now C, uh, option A and option B, both options are correct but more accurate option is option number B, micro architecture. Because we are uh, talking about internal components, so the uh, correct option is micro architecture. Although uh, option A is also correct but more accurate answer is option B. Next question. What is the characteristics of next generation processors for a smartphone and tab tablets? Option A, increased power consumption. Option B, larger physical size. Option C is enhanced energy efficiency. And last option is decreased processing speed. Correct option is option C, enhanced energy efficiency. Next question. What is the role of micro architecture in computer processors? Option A. Defining the processor's instruction set. Option B. Implementing high, the high-level algorithm. 
ऑप्शन सी ऑर्गेनाइजिंग एंड डिजाइनिंग द इंटरनल कॉम्पोनेंट्स लास्ट ऑप्शन इज मैनेजिंग द प्रोसेसर क्लॉक स्पीड करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन सी ऑर्गेनाइजिंग द डिजाइन एंड द इंटरनल कॉम्पोनेंट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच फीचर इज ऑफन इंप्रूव इन द लेटेस्ट प्रोसेसर आर्किटेक्चर टू एनहेंस परफॉर्मेंस ऑप्शन इज एनर्जी इफिशियंसी ऑप्शन बी क्लॉक स्पीड फिजिकल साइज और मेमोरी कैपेसिटी करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन बी विच इज क्लॉक स्पीड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इन द कॉन्टेक्सट ऑफ कंप्यूटर आर्किटेक्चर वॉट डोज द टर्म इंस्ट्रक्शन सेट रेफर्स टू वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन एंड करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन ए वनली द सेट ऑफ ऑपरेशन अ प्रोसेसर कैन परफॉर्म नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन Which representation is commonly used for floating point number in computer arithmetic? Option A, two's complement. Option B, access three code. Option C, I triple E seven five four standard. And last option is gray code. Correct option is C, I triple E seven five four standard. Next question. What is the primary purpose of the carry clock, a head adder in computer arithmetic? Option A, minimizing power consumption. Option B, reducing the number of partial products. Option C is improving precision in results. Last option is speeding up additional operations. Correct option is option C, improving precision in results. If you use carry look ahead adder, it will improve precision in results. Next question. In the context of parallel processing, what does the term speed up, speed up refers to? option is the increase in clock speed option b the improvement in energy efficiency option c is the ratio of the performance of a parallel system to a sequential system and last option is the reduction in interconnection complexity correct option is option c the ratio of the performance of a parallel system to a sequential system next question Which type of parallel processing architecture allows multiple processors to work on different tasks independently? Option A, SIMD. Option B, MIMD. And MIMD is the correct option. Option C is SPMD. And last option is SIST. Correct option is MIMD. Multiple instruction, multiple data. Next question. What is the significance of risk architecture in modern processor? option a it it uses a large set of complex in, instruction it prioritizes small set of simple instruction option c is it focus on graphic processing and last option is it is designed for quantum computing correct option is option c only it prioritizes a small set of simple instruction next question Which technology is commonly used to increase the efficiency of cache memory in modern processor? Again, the questions of cache memory came. Cache memory, a concept of cache memory is very important for your exam. Option A, magnetic storage. Option B, DDR. Technology option C is SRM, and last option is optical storage. Correct option is option C, SRM. next question and this is the second last question of this series what is a key feature of the harvard architecture in computer system option a shared memory for instruction and data option b separate memory space for instruction and data option c is single memory space for both instruction and data last option is exclusive use of cache memory correct option is b separate memory space for instruction and data let's come to the last question which component plays a crucial role in the efficiency of out of order execution in modern processor correct option is option c branch predictor is the correct option guys this was the last question thank you so much for watching the video i will upload one more videos in which we will see the combined question 30 we will see 30 mcqs from all the unit mix mix mcqs we can see till then take care guys bye bye thank you so much for watching the video thank you so much